Welcome to Tech Results Dhamir. In this video, we are going to learn about split function in Cousteau. So split function uh, splits a given uh, string according to given delimiter and returns a string array with the contained uh, substrings. Uh, optionally, a specify a specific uh, string can be returned uh, if exist. Uh, now let's go ahead and take a look uh, on uh, how split works in Cousteau. Here uh, I have a definition for my customer table and I'm going to create this table with the customer ID, first name, last name, and file location. So maybe there is some photos or some specific files that this customer has been saving and we would like to save the path for that. So I'm gonna create the table first and then we'll insert the records. Let's ingest some data. Now let me take a look on the data itself. So just to select the customer table and run the query. Now you can see that we have customer ID, we have first name, last name, and then we have a file location. So this uh, uh, customer, Amit Shahzad, he's the file is saved on C drive documents, uh, newsletter, summer 2018.pdf, and there is uh, another one, uh, Raza Ali, his file is saved right there on D drive. Now, if we would like to split this, uh, and uh, what it's gonna do is gonna convert uh, this uh, file uh, location uh, column into the array. So this is how we, we will do that. Uh, so we'll say table name, and then a pipe sign extender. So we are creating extra column uh, by using extender. So these columns will stay as it is, and there would be new column will be added uh, by as we are saying extender. Now we will use a split function here, file location, that's the column name, and then we are telling the delimiter. In my case, as it is backslash, so I'm using a two backslashes. Let's execute and see what it returns us. So you see right there, we have this file location right there, and now so we have it converted to the array. So I see square parentheses around it, and then each value is the uh, whatever after the backslash is the converted value c colon so the next value is the uh, documents comma uh, newsletters comma and you know around each of the value we have double quotes so so look at this one in d drive as well so it's converted to the different uh, values inside the array now if we would like to do we can further uh, split this uh, array into sub arrays here so Instead of having single array here, uh, what we can do, we can go for each of the file. So let's say if I would like to only get the first value in that array, and uh, I would like to call that uh, as a drive name, um, not driver name, so I would write drive name. Okay, so in this case, if I run till here, what's gonna happen is gonna create a, a column called uh, drive name and split, uh, so it will get the file location so it is going to start from here but to get the very first value from the array and uh, uh, sorry from the column and this show us as a single array value here c colon d colon and then this is blank now i can go for the next one so I first uh, second value from here so that's uh, our document documents here so i can split uh, this and uh, use the file location same again uh, and uh, in this case i would like to get the first uh, sorry second value from that uh, uh, values here and can and uh, have that as an array as well uh, and uh, then i go for subfolders and file name and uh, that's how i went uh, to create uh, multiple arrays um, so see right there we have drive name then we have main folder subfolder and file name so you can do that as well but that's not really interesting as well we would like to get, rather get just the values in each column so how we do that first of all i'm going to go ahead and say customer that's get me everything from customer then i'm going to use pipe sign here extend and i'm giving a name to this a new column i'm calling this call my array and equal to split using this function and the name of the actual column and then telling you with which value you should split. So it is backslash, you can see right there here. So now we execute this and it's gonna create an array. It's called the my array, see right there. So we have an array and different values are there. Now from this array, I can extract each value and then show in a different column as well. So I use extend here again and I said drive name. And then from my array, I'm getting the first value. Then comma, I'm creating another column here and uh, that's a main folder and they're uh, using the second value and uh, right there and then uh, i'm using the and creating another column and uh, using uh, getting the value from my array the third value right there and keep going on so this is how if i run together if 
first it is split it into an array and then from the array I extracted these values and created those uh, columns. Um, so this is how it will look. Uh, often we come to these scenarios uh, where we have these uh, uh, values uh, sitting there and we have to convert them to an uh, JSON array or also after that maybe we want to get the single values out uh, we can use the split function in uh, Kusto. Thank you very much for watching. I will put the script in, script in the description so you can use for experiment and uh, go ahead and subscribe my channel and I will see you guys in the next video.